Investigators in Chilton tonight looking into what caused an overnight fire that destroyed a historic 150 year old church. The Moorville United Methodist Church is a total loss. Flames could be seen 60 to 70 feet into the air. Fox 44's Noelle Mendoza joins us live in Chilton from the scene. Noelle, this is a big loss for the community. Yeah, lastly, as you can imagine, the church has 200 members heartbroken tonight. Most of them have been coming to this church their entire lives. In these pages, memories of a building that is no more. There I am presenting the oldest attendee, and that was my father-in-law. And Phelps represents the fifth generation in her family to worship at Moorville United Methodist Church. It's the love and the fellowship and people who have been a part of this church or who lived in the area always feel ties to Moorville. She can't believe it's gone. I was just shocked and devastated just the very idea of losing our church sanctuary, our building that's was so old and meant so much to so many, many people. The doorbell rang and uh, they said the church is on fire. Your heart stops. Five fire departments from Falls County and two from McLennan assisted in putting out the flames. This is a big part of the history in Falls County, especially for this community. You know, and to see some, see all your history just go up in flames, you know, it's heartbreaking. And although the building is gone, the Moorville Fellowship is stronger than ever. It's going to be okay. It is a tragic, tragic loss. But that history, that history, it remains here. And it remains here. And um, uh, it's just a beautiful, beautiful church. And it's so sad to see it go. But Moorville United Methodist Church will continue. Now the cause of the fire is still under investigation and Sunday service will be held at the Fellowship Hall right behind me. The church is collecting donations. I'll have more information on how you can donate on our website, centexproud.com. Live in Chilton, Noelle Mendoza, Fox 44 News. All right, thank you, Noelle.